Hello everyone, this is Mark from www.englishmark.net. We have uh, a special request and uh, uh, this is, as you can see from the diagram, the, the difference between who and whom. Okay, we can all agree that they are pronouns. So who refers to the subject of the sentence in the red box, you can see that. In the green box, with whom refers to the object of the verb, of a verb. So whom refers to the object of a verb. So I wrote two sentences, he is to who, okay? Instead, for whom, him is to whom. And below, I wrote in the red box, used without preposition. And uh, in the green box, is used with a preposition. I show you how. I gave you two um, examples. The, one, the first one is a, a question and the second one is a sentence, a normal sentence. So, uh, the first example for who is who saw you. So, I'm asking for the subject of a sentence. Instead, the first example of the green box, of the who green box, whom did you eat the pizza with? So, as you can see, we have a preposition here, with. So, this tells us that we are asking for the object of the verb. So, I ate the pizza with Mary. And Mary is whom? With her. Okay? Or with John. With him. Okay? This is whom. Then the second uh, example is a positive sentence. In the who box, so in the red box, a woman who I think is a genius. Okay? So I'm referring to the subject, to the woman. Whom instead, the example of whom, we wondered whom the book was about. So the book was about her or him. Okay? So this is for whom. So we have to make clear though that um, who is is in used more than whom and actually i wrote below who common practice in current english is to use who in all contexts so whom is disappearing i'm sure you won't use whom it's important that you know the difference and that if you see it written, because whom is usually used in written English, you know what it means, okay? So there you have it, the difference between who and whom. Have a great day and please share my videos. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.